over a hundred days since the uprising, and Iran continues its clampdown against anti-hijab protesters. Tehran announced death penalties for people involved in the massive protests that have rocked the country. In the latest, British media reports say that London might soon declare the Iran Revolutionary Guard as a terrorist group. Iran's Revolutionary Guard has arrested seven people with links to the United Kingdom over anti-government protests. The move is expected to be formally announced soon and is supported by the UK Security Minister Tom Tugendhat and Home Secretary Suella Braverman. This means it would become a criminal offence to belong to the group or attend its meetings and carry its logo in public. On Wednesday, UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak urged Iran to stop detaining dual nationals, adding that the practice should not be used to obtain diplomatic leverage. Analysts and experts say that Tehran has been using death sentences as a way to intimidate people after it failed to quell the nationwide unrest. Two 23-year-old men have already been executed over the protests that were sparked by the death of Massa Amini back in September 2022. The Iranian judiciary, until now, has handed down a total of 11 death sentences in connection with the protests, which Iranian officials describe as riots.